for, for yielding, he mentioned uh, double standard. That's all we've got from this administration relative to COVID is a double standard and a mixed message. I mean, double standard. I remember the, the, the governor of California uh, going to a dinner with lobbyists and friends and family, no mask. At the same time, he was telling the folks he's, he represents in his state that they couldn't have Thanksgiving with their family. I mean, talk about mixed message. But Dr. Fauci said no mask, then one mask, then two masks, then one mask, then no mask. Now back to one mask. I mean, they've been all over the place. Yesterday, yesterday the Vice President, Vice President Harris, let me just find it. Vice President Harris tweeted out this. Vice President Harris said, by vaccinating, increasing our testing and masking, and protecting the vaccinated, we can end this pandemic, which sort of raises an obvious question. If the vaccine protects, why do the vaccinated need protecting? I think it's a pretty, pretty basic question. So they've been all over the place on mixed messages. I think the gentleman's amendment from, uh, the gentleman from California, his amendment is simply like, look, if you're gonna mandate it for American citizens, and if they don't get it, they may lose their job. Doesn't it make sense for people who are coming into this country, particularly coming here illegally, that they should have to get it? Pretty common sense. I bet the folks I represent in the 4th District of Ohio would say, yeah, that makes kind of common sense to me. That's all this amendment says. But no, the Democrats say, no, we're going to mandate it for American citizens, but we're not going to mandate it for people who come to the country illegally. That makes no sense. There's not a person I represent, I would bet, in the 4th District of Ohio who would agree with their position. But that's their position. And there's not anyone in the whole country who, who understands what the vice president is saying yesterday in this tweet by vaccinating, increasing our testing and masking and protecting the vaccinated, we can end this pandemic. What? I don't get it. If the vaccine protects, why do the vaccinated need protecting? I don't get it. I do not get it. But again, that's, that's the one thing consistent from the Biden administration relative to COVID is their inconsistency. That's the one thing we know. With that, I yield back to the gentleman from Oregon.